Jesus, who is the peace, the Prince of Peace, in the midst of a storm, water's coming over the side, he's just chilling. He's like, I don't know where you guys are doing this. I'm just chilling. I'm relaxing. I have peace in my life. And then, the, and then it says this, the disciples woke him and said to him, teacher, don't you care if we drown? So I'm going to pause right there just for a second. And I think it's important to say that the other boat set around. I can just imagine, when I read the word of God, I just imagine what, what it's like during that time. And I'm just thinking the other boats are, are in there like, hey, Peter, Peter, yo, wh- dude, we're getting swamped over here. Are you going to wake Jesus up and calm this? We've, he's seen him heal. Or are they just thinking, Oh, this is what 2020 is going to feel like. <laughs> Jesus, in his calmness, is sleeping when chaos is all around. And this is what he says. He got up and rebuked the wind and said to the waves, quiet, be still. Another version says, peace, be still. Then the wind died down and it was completely calm. He said to the disciples, why are you so afraid? Do you still have no faith? And they were terrified and asked each other, who is this? Even the winds and the waves obey him. The storms are guaranteed. How about that? How uplifting is that? We're going to talk about peace and understand that storms will happen in your life. The saved don't escape storms. We just know what to do with them. Storms will happen, but us who call upon the Lord now know how to handle the storms as they come upon us.